Hey there, my name is Jacob from the Larimer County Conservation Corps. Today we're going to be talking about aerators and what faucet aerators do and how to install a new one on your kitchen or bathroom faucet. Under your kitchen or bathroom faucet, there is a small water restrictor that helps limit the flow of water and produces a nice stream. Here is an example of a kitchen aerator. This sink has a male slash female aerator that we can simply screw off counterclockwise. Without an aerator, your water flow would look like this. This is obviously not ideal and can be replaced with a new aerator. You may need to use a wrench. Once hand tightened, ensure no leakage. This change can save more than a gallon of water per minute. Not all faucets have a detachable aerator like this and may require a more specialized replacement or a complete replacement of the faucet fixture if you desire additional savings. After installation, make sure to test the faucet to ensure proper function. If there is leaking around the aerator, try tightening further. If this does not fix the issue, try a new rubber gasket. Aerators not only reduce your water use, but help to keep small particulate matter out of your drinking water. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in any other installation tips or would like any other information, you can visit us at our website at www.larimer.org/ewd/energy.